Hey! Hey you kid! Huh? Me? Yeah, yeah you! What? Have you ever had... T p troubles with having random wedge cut out of your head? Slash hair? Uh... Yeah, kinda. As you can see by my hair. Well, buy a wedge- a hair wedge today and make that space feel less empty. That was the stupidest intro I've ever done in my entire life. Uh... That was my, um, amazing attempt at being funny. Th th thank you guys. I, I, I just really wanted a clap from someone, even if it was myself. <laughs> Anyways, welcome to freaking Let's Plays. Oh my lord, what the heck are these guys? Stalfos. Look up close to you and watch its movement carefully. Attack it when it drops. We never followed these as a kid, did we? I don't think we did. If we did, it was only one or something. Anyways, when he drops his shield randomly, can you drop your shield randomly? No, oh fine. No, or just jumps behind me. We are fighting a freaking skeletons that are like 10 foot 5 or something. Oh no, oh no. We might die here. That would be fantastic if I didn't though. Stop! You're raping me! Not really, that, that's offensive. In five different languages. Stop! I was left behind him, he just kind of stood there. Look, he just kind of stands there when I walk behind him. I find that humorous. Unknown reasons. Whoa, this, the camera's going all sideways and such. Bye. Goodbye, my puppies. I don't know what happens when they do this. Are we getting the item of the dungeon right here? No, what is this? It's just, it's just, is it just a key? Well, crap, I wish I came here first. I think we could have accessed this straight from the beginning. I mean, there's no nothing here blocking us. What is this? A freaking key? What is that over there? A coffee machine? All right. Well, I guess that's that. I really wish I went here first. Apparently. <laughs> no. Okay. We just run by you. Goodbye. We'll never be in this room again. It's always weird to me thinking about that in video games. Like, we will never be through this door ever again, forever, never, ever. Although it looks like. No. I was gonna say, it looks like it's on the second floor as well, but apparently not. Oh well. <laughs> uh, which door do we need to go to? I think it's this- no, it's not that one. I think it's this way. Should I just fast forward? Because we've already walked through here like three times. We walked through this puzzle like three times only to find out we need the freaking key. I thought we were gonna get the item of the dungeon there. I guess that wouldn't have made any sense since it's like- I, It looks like you can go through there as the first- um, door in the game, or the temple at least, not the game. <laughs> That's right, when you first start a new game on this game, game game, you spawn in that room and you open the door. That's the first thing you do. And it makes absolutely no sense, but it does right now. I don't, I'm, I am think I'm starting to go crazy, to be honest. If you more than one energy drink, it's probably a bad idea for me. Because it tries to be a little bit patty. <laughs> My crazy voice. You like it. <laughs> that wall looks like it's way too big to jump up. Why is that so hard to jump up? I don't have a hand. I don't have a hand. Alright, so we're gonna go this way. I'm gonna, I guess we're just gonna keep talking through this stupid puzzle. I mean, it's not even a puzzle anymore, it's just a long process of me going through the same room we've gone through in the past two episodes. As we look at the ice switch with our own eye. At least we get to go through the cool curvy room, though. So what I was initially gonna do in this room was I knew the wall masters existed, but I was gonna totally let them follow me and see what happens. Does it just damage me? Or is it like, you know, I'll just find it right now. Whee! Oh god, he just picks me up and throws me that. Really? I'll throw it back. Stupid teleporting, teleporting, teleporting death hands and their stupid ability to teleport you through the dungeon for no reason. I thought it was just gonna damage me! I knew it teleports you from in like uh, Wind Waker, but I didn't realize that was gonna be. Whoa. Is that a mirror? Oh, I thought there was another one at the other side. I was like, whoa, what's going on? You could totally see that it flicker a little bit in the bottom, but that's like glitchy. <laughs> There's another one! Uh... That's really... What the... Oh, the picture frames? Hey, wait a minute. 
Why does that guy have a stack of hay as hair? <laughs> it's gonna be so weird. They're like little dark blobs with arms. They just kind of float there and have a little shirt on, and then like that would just have the haystack in his hair. Reminds me of Pitfall. Who's that? Huh? He's gone. Well, that's creepy. That's actually kind of really creepy, to be honest. Pictures moving and such. What's this do? Well, we have Din's fire, we might as well use it. See what happens. Oh, I never look like Shimbo told me something about it. Light it up! Or not. This... This is the same torch we saw at the entrance to the temple! Isn't it? Isn't it? Well, actually, the entrance of the temple just had, you know... Two... Uh, wolfos in it and had nothing... Whoa! Those guys were- He was flat in the ground! What?! <laughs> that was good, she's all heck. Pro tip, don't fall down that hole. I don't know where it leads, but it leads somewhere bad. Alright, can you just die already, sir? You need to just die already, sir. I got the cool red swords, though. Like, look at it, it's all ruby-looking and such. Nope, nope, jump attacks do not seem to be effective, it seems. I just have to use Din's fire. We get a really glitchy angle, it seems. Light his bane's on fire! Oh. Somehow his shield is fireproof, and so are the rest of his bones, apparently. Although you do need a super, like, intense amount of heat to burn bones. <laughs> I like how these guys, like, they look, they're supposed to look like they come on the ground, but you could just see they're, like, flat models, and they just, like, get stretched upwards. Thankfully, none of you are you guys don't gang, gang up on me and you just fight me one at a time for some strange reason. There we go. Come on, get you with it. Nope, nope, I was too I was too slow to the draw. Come on, just attack me. There we go. Whoa! Slow down? That was weird. I think I got slow down there. Dudes, come on, so you just need to give up. Clearly I'm way better than you in any way, shape, and form. I mean, you are getting hits off on me, though, so that's a good sign for you, not really for me. Well, no, I'm curious, what would happen if I jumped down the hole? Do I just die? What's what's below me? We're in that room. No, I'm trying to look. There we go. Would I just fall into that center room? It looks like maybe. I don't really freaking know. Do you freaking know? Does anybody know? Does anybody know? You know, this game is actually surprisingly more- No, I didn't mean to do that! I did not mean to press that button. Maybe it'll break that pot for me, though. Yay, incinerating pots, but it didn't even work like I actually thought I was going to. Alright, give me the thing. What do I got? What do I got? What you gonna give me? What you gonna give me? Huh? Huh? What you gonna give me? Give it to me! <laughs> I got the fairy bow! Which is weird, because the fairy- Like, everything named fairy besides the bow the fairy slingshot, the fairy boomerang, and that's really it. <laughs> that's used as a children thing. Shouldn't this be called the hero's bow or some crap? I don't freak. Whoa. We have two ways to go. Also, I am missing the compass, and that kind of concerns me, because I do not know if we were supposed to have had that already or not. Let's go this way. One more interruption later. Alright, now this is... This is not a door we haven't been yet. Okay, let's go and examine that um, painting we saw then, or that I guess yeah, I guess it was a painting. I was calling it a mirror before, but I guess that's a painting. I thought it was just a blacked out mirror, or like a mirror with a broken out back. So it's like you know you couldn't see that was a mirror anymore. That is not the equipment screen. And our equipment screen is actually quickly filling up. This game has seemed shorter than I remember it being so far. So that's so weird. All right, so. Okay, if you walk too close to it, it seems to disappear. So what you actually want to do is go... Splish. And by the way, the archery game we played a few episodes ago where I got nothing for completing it. Well, this is why. <laughs> I didn't have the bow and arrow yet. You get something, but you actually need your own bow and arrow first. Why does it get too close to you now? Nothing. You can't teleport anymore. You can't be a teleporting, teleporting, teleporting ghost. Oh no, it's a haste head! My question is, oh, quick look at the arrow? Nope. <laughs> it's not gonna be like one of those arrows in Minecraft where it's like they stay there forever. What do you say? Joel? 
One of the Poe sisters. Aim for her when she appears. All right, so like all Poe's, you don't want to target them. No, I don't want to. Where'd you go? Oh, there you go. Where'd you go? You can jump attack her, which is really sad. And I to why is your hay here not catch fire, ma'am? Right, oops, I totally did that to move the camera. You can't adjust the camera because when you do, you walk on and then she disappears. Like a boot head. There you go. You must die! Okay then, or not. Or I must die. Okay, fine. Can you please just take gosh dog dig damage? I think what you're supposed to do here is actually use your bow and arrow on her, but she just takes forever. It takes a lot longer because the bow and arrow does kind of crappy damage. I guess letting them hit you stops them from attacking! Okay, let's, there we go. Take damage and then attack. Oh, we could, whoa! We could attack her multiple times? Alright, hit me with your best shot. Fire up with. Why are you not up here? There we go. There we go! Only took like most of my life and you didn't even hurt, you dick. Did we even get treasure chests from this? What? Twat? Alright, so there's four flames. Which means there's gonna probably be four flame sisters we fight. We got the key! Beautiful. Ten, ten out of ten! That just looks like a normal fire to me. This torch is lit! That means that it has fuel in it. Thanks, Navi. You're the best. Around! Nothing gonna have to keep you down! Is there nothing in here anymore? Dude! I hit the. Dude! Dude! Is that port too shot? The port? The pot too short? That pot too shot? Too short? Good lord. I can't speak. <laughs> Alright, let's head. No! In the room, please! I got angry for zero reasons there. I apologize. Give me hearts, please. I don't need arrows. I got one heart out of that, really. I'm totally gonna have to fight these. PP heads and normal. Dang it! Oh, there, there she blows. What? Is she back here? Oh, she. Dude! Would you cut that out? Am I in. Am I in like the perfect sweet spot wherever I. Oh, seriously? This sucks. There we go. That was weird. And yeah, as you would imagine, if you hit these without people in it, nothing happens. Can I get that arrow back? I, I believe you can get your arrows back in this game, right? Oh, you can. Okay, I guess that's just in later Zelda games. Later Zelda games. There we go. Hey there with your best shot! This one also has kind of like hay-ish hair. I don't understand why they go to the bottom. They should just fight you where they were, right? What do you say? What's your name? Beth! One of the Poe sisters, and for when she appears! Okay, so we'll fight this one with the bow and arrow because we kind of need you. Did she not disappear when we walked on? Do we not? I feel like we have to fight. Well, so bone arrow interrupt their attacks. Maybe you're just—you don't even care that I'm here, do you, dude? I hit you straight in the head. That was like a perfect Robin Hood shot in the middle of the forehead. <laughs> this is slowly coming towards me. Are you dead yet? See what I mean? I don't like using bone arrow because it takes freaking forever. Oh, hurry up! Such a fun fight, woo! <laughs> like how they burn to a crisp. And this one's a blue fire, yay! Oh, is this gonna be the compass? Oh no, I spoiled the fact there's a compass! Oh no, lay gas pay! And... We got the compass! Yay! <laughs> now the question is, have we missed any chests? The answer is, of course we have. What, a, what am I, a good Lost player? Pfft. Mostly in rooms I haven't been in. Alright. Alright. Interesting. We've only missed two chests of the rooms we've been in so far. However, that's only that's half the chests we have left to get, so that is kind of a bad thing. Alrighty. We have a key, thankfully. It scared me for like I saw the locked door and I did not remember if I had a key. I glanced down and like, just hooped to all heck that we had it. Oh, what? Watch for the shadow of the monsters that hang from the ceiling! Stupid monsters that hang from- Is this a different room? I'm actually confused. Have you been here before? Is this the same room? It is not. Is it? Okay, this just looks like that room that slants- that's like sideways. With the, that one weird looking chest on the side of the wall. 
Don't you dare! Don't! Stop! Oh, maybe not. Oh my good lord. There we go. <laughs> I hate you so much. You don't really scare me, but I mean, it's still kind of. You're kind of still kind of scary, to be honest. You don't scare me, but you're still kind of scary, to be honest. Wow. Logic Award 2010 for me, please. Please. Alright. So, is there anything else in here? Like, I guess not. I mean, there's no chest, because I have a compass, and there's no chest here, so, I mean, that should have probably been a good indication that there's nothing. This room here just to mock me? It's a green bubble! Green bubble! Use your sword when it's green fire vanishes! So we just can't, like, you know, hit it with a shield? No. We can. Alright. Alrighty then. Are you kidding me? We need a key here, too? Dude! What? You need a key to <laughs> Thank you. It is indeed chained in a very awkward X pattern. Well, it's not an awkward X pattern, but it's like, seriously, you do not need a key to get through there. Let's be honest. You could just step aside. Huh. There is a chest on the first floor here, but it doesn't seem... Can you pull this up or some crap? Well, it doesn't look like we can, but we can try it. I mean, I don't have any memories of this stuff being blown up. But, I mean, there's a lot of stuff I don't remember. I should probably just replace not the... Arrows, to be honest, no. You ever wondered? You can actually only take off three bombs at once. Wait, can you not? Oh, there we go. Oh, guess we can't blow up that. <laughs> I believe, yeah, I believe you can only have three bombs out at once. And if you have more, if you try to pull another one, it goes bim bim As you saw. All right, guess it's gonna have to be another room we return to. This, I should seriously have finished this temple in this. Level? No, in this episode, but it's not looking like that's gonna happen. I can guarantee it's not gonna happen, actually. <sighs> I say it like it's funny, but it's really not. It's pretty sad, actually. Actually? Alrighty, well, I guess we's going keys hunting's is... So, I guess in the next episode... We will go... Well, actually, we do have... Oh, oh. wait a minute! Wait. Oh man. Huh. Oh man, it resets whenever you jump, really? I don't like that. I just want to deal with you. Uh, just keep running, just keep running. There we go. As soon as you see the shadow stop moving, they are good. You're in the clear, unless for some stupid reason you decide to walk back. Can you please just give me hearts? I would really like it if you dropped like seven hearts or something like that. That'd be nice. That'd be fan freaking fantastic. Alright. Uh, well, this is the correct room we actually want to be in. However, because it's slanted sideways. Should we do this in this episode? Let's deal with it. No, you know what? We'll leave the wonderment for the next episode. You sort of need to die. Holy crap, you just flung across this. Dude, you guys are so fast. Why are y'all so fast, y'all? Dude, seriously. Oh my good lord, these are so annoying to go after. I thought those. You see that arrow that came out of them? I totally thought it was a bone. <laughs> Come on, seriously? Yeah. In the next episode, we'll hit that eye switch with our bone arrow. And we'll see the magic that happens because it's actually pretty freaking cool. I'll talk to you guys later. Goodbye.